Take me to your camp. I want to have a look at it. Very good. I'll go ahead. Follow me. Here we are. Down there lies the camp of the Brotherhood. Go through the gate and speak to my brothers. I'm sure you haven't come here for nothing. Ask for Kor Kalam. He's in charge of the novices and tutors. 
I'll go back to the old camp. There are still many infidels who need to be guided to the right path. Good luck. Greetings, stranger. You're treading on holy ground. This is the Brotherhood of the Sleeper. What brings you here? I'm new here. I wanted to have a look at your camp. Strangers are welcome here, but it's important to follow our rules. There are certain areas strangers may not access. How are things in the camp? Everything's quiet. Just go in. Is everything all right, pal? The sleeper be with you. You addressed a guru. Never do that again. It's sacrilege. If a master wants to talk to you, he shall address you. Who are you? I'm Lester. I take care of the strangers who arrive here. Tell me something about the camp. What do you want to know? What do you know about the weed? Well, the weed's grown in the swamp. Of course it has to be processed before it can be smoked. That's what we novices do. The weeds have a tranquilizing and relaxing effect. They help you concentrate on the essentials and increase your awareness. We trade them for goods from the old camp, and we use them to recruit new people as well. The result is, of course, that some people only join us for the weed. Well, at least they help us with the work in the camp. What can you tell me about the sleeper? The sleeper's a divine creature. He causes visions, at least to the gurus. We pray to him, for he will give us freedom. And you believe that? Hey, I've been inside the barrier for two years. Do you know how long two years can be? You can't imagine what I'm willing to believe and do, just to get out of here again. Tell me about the guilds. The gurus form the highest guild. They are the spirit of this camp, for they have great power. The Templars use their spiritual power in battle. They have an indomitable willpower. You should never get into trouble with them. As for myself, I am a novice. We pray to the sleeper and do all the work in the camp. Some of the novices are allowed to join the gurus, but to get that far, you need to study for many years. But I want to talk to your master. Forget it. I'm sure I can help you with any of your problems. May the sleeper protect you. How can I find my way around here in the camp? I can show you the most important places. I want to become a member of the Brotherhood. Kor Kalom decides whether you're ready to join the Brotherhood, but he relies on the advice of other gurus. Bal Namib over there is one of them. First, you'll have to prove that you're worthy, and then one of the gurus will send you to Kor Kalom. 
How's that supposed to work if none of the gurus will talk to me? It might not look like it, but the gurus observe everything you do here in the camp. If they think that you deserve to become a member of the community, they'll talk to you. You're bound to have opportunities in the camp to prove that you're worthy. Show me the way. To the tutors. Follow me. What are you doing here? I'm teaching the words of the sleeper to the novices. I'm still a novice myself, but soon I'll be a Baal, one of the gurus. I've even spoken to Iberian. He's the chosen one. He told me that if I work hard, I can soon be a master myself. But I'm still putting that off. There's no rush, you understand? I can still become a master anytime. At the moment, I'm quite happy about my current task. What's your task here? I test the new substances developed by Kor Kalam in his alchemy lab with my pals here. His aide gives us something new every couple of days, and we test it. This weed opens your spirit. If you take the right amount, you can get in touch with the sleeper. Have you ever been in contact with the sleeper? No, not yet. But that's because we never get enough of the stuff. Kalam always wants to hear about the effect of it, but I get the impression he's not really interested in my opinion at all. If I find the stuff stimulating, he passes it straight on to the gurus. But soon, I'll be a guru myself. Then I can go right to my limits and listen to the voice of the sleeper myself. I'd like to join your camp. Can you help me? You want to join us? That's good. Just wait. Yes, I think I can help you. I'm not a guru yet, but I have some influence in the Brotherhood. You'd have to do me a favor. Have you seen Fortuno yet? Then go. See him and collect your daily ration. If you leave me all the swamp weed he gives you, we're in business. I'll think about it. Hi, you aren't from this camp, are you? Well, now, I am. I left the old camp a week ago. Told my pal Dusty to come along, but he wanted to wait. I know Dusty. I talked to him for a short time. If you meet him again, tell him that he was dumb to stay there. It's ten times better than getting harassed by the guards in the old camp. I'll tell him if I see him again. Down there, you'll find Baal Kadar. He teaches the novices. Climbing up this ladder will take you to the Templar's training ground. I'll wait for you right here. If you fall behind, I'll be with Baal Namib again at the entrance to the camp. How can I get your master to talk to me? You have to know what he wants to hear. And that is? Listen. When we're with him the next time, you'll address me and we'll have a little talk. Baal Namib is worried because many of the novices don't only pray to the sleeper, but also to their former gods. 
you'll tell me that you've renounced the old gods and that, in future, you'll pray only to the sleeper. Then I'll ask you why you made this decision, and you'll say that you had a vision in which the sleeper summoned you. He'll be interested then. Do you think you'll manage that? No problem. May the sleeper protect you. Can you train me? Out of my sight, unworthy one. I instruct only the Sleeper's Templars. Will you train me? You want to become a strong warrior. So now you're looking for someone to instruct you. Commendable, but I'm not the man you want. I dedicate my time only to those belonging to the Holy Circle of Templars. How can I become a Templar? First, you will have to serve as a novice for a while to prove that you truly believe in the Sleeper. Then come back to me and I will instruct you. Korangar has spoken to you? What did he say? He said I should come back as soon as I'm a Templar. It would appear he has a high opinion of you. He never speaks to anybody. It is an honor even to be noticed by him. The last time he spoke to me, was about two months ago. Show me the way. To the blacksmith shop. Follow me. That's the smithy. Have a look around. I'll wait here for about an hour. Then I'll leave. That's rude. That was a time. Hi, I'm new here and I'd like to get to know the camp. Then you've come to the wrong place. Since the Templars started preparing for the fight, we've been busy day and night. I don't have much time for questions, so don't disturb me, unless you want to buy something.
something that I never outplay. I'd like to trade with you. Good. Here, these are the weapons I have available at the moment. I better keep out of it. Same old story every time. That wasn't very clever. You don't look like one who submitted to slavery under the ore barons. You look more like a seeker, someone who's searching for the true faith. Do you not feel a fire inside your body which keeps you from sleeping at night? I see. You doubt that what the ore baron slaves try to tell you is really true and just. You know why you doubt them too? They're lying. With those lies, they try to control weak spirits. But your spirit is stronger than their lies. Don't you feel a longing for freedom every single day? Don't you feel it growing stronger? It guides your spirit. Let it happen! Do you know what you're doing when you try to suppress it? You're denying your soul, denying yourself. Don't let your fears dominate your life. Free yourself. You need to understand. The sleeper will awaken. He will set you free and wash away all these disbelieving infidels. Like dross that is washed away by the rain, they will vanish from this world. They will moan, whine, and repent. But it will be too late. Then they will pay the price. They will pay with their blood and with their lives. Hey, you've spoken to me. Does that mean I may talk to you now? I see you've become familiar with our rules. That's good. I can feel your great spiritual strength. Soon you'll be allowed to join our community. I have spoken to you, 
because I wanted to give you a chance to prove your loyalty. How can I prove my loyalty? Most of all, we need new souls to join our community. By recruiting one more man to our camp, you will prove that you're willing to do good service to our community. Where can I recruit new members for the Brotherhood? The old camp is a good place to try since a lot of the people there are fed up with fear and lies. They just need some kind of support. I guess you won't be very successful in the new camp. The men living there are barbarians. Why are you so desperate for new members? The sleeper has spoken to our master, revealing that he has an important message for us. However, he has not gathered full strength yet. That's why he needs our strength to contact us. Therefore, we are preparing a great invocation, and the more men participate, the likelier we are to be successful. If you want to know more about it, go to the large court in front of the Temple Hill. But don't disturb our master in his meditations. Hi, where are you off to? We take the Minecrawler secretion from our brothers in the old mine to Kor Kalam. We go to the old mine every day to collect it. What kind of secretion is it? We obtain it from the mandibles of the Minecrawlers. If you know how to do it, you can take them out without losing the secretion. What does Kor Kalam need the secretion for? As far as I know, he makes a potion with it which increases the magic powers of a novice. Since we are preparing for the great invocation, he can't get enough of the stuff. With the aid of the potion, he'll prepare the novices for the great day. Have you enough of the potion for the great invocation of the sleeper? No, we still have to collect much more. Our mind crawler hunting units are in action day and night. Have you enough of the potion for the great invocation? No. Can you tell me how to get the secretion of a mind crawler? Of course. After you've killed the beast, you get hold of the mandibles and pull them straight out. This way you'll get the secretion gland without destroying it. I'm sure you won't mind me going in there. If you're disrespectful to my master, I'll kill you. What do you want? One of the merchants from the old camp would like to have the recipe for a healing potion. My recipes are not for sale. What kind of experiments do you do? My research takes place on a level you don't understand anything about, boy. So don't waste my time. I'm not listening to all the blathering anymore. 
I would like to join the Brotherhood. I've heard you're the master of the novices and that you decide who's allowed to join. I don't have time. My experiments are too important for me to spend any time on new novices. I'll rely on the judgment of the Baals. When they say you're ready to wear the robe of a novice, come back to me. <laughs>